I wanted to make this cute little car and decided to share how I went about making it. Please subscribe and leave a like if you think my tutorials are helpful. I do need a bit of encouragement and motivation to keep making tutorials like this, so please support me that way. Let's begin. I'm gonna start with a simple cube. Move it up and press N to access auto mirror button. Add a subsurf and scale it in edit mode. Control R to add some loop cuts. A tip here is to have as few loop cuts as possible in the beginning. Put it where you think is absolutely necessary. You can always add more geometry later on for details. You don't have to follow the reference image exactly since it's a stylized car anyway. Let's select these two faces and extrude. I'm adding another loop cut because I want some sharpness here. I'm making the rear longer on purpose for the wheels later on. The base shape is ready, so I'm adding more loop cuts. I'm just fine tuning the shape here. You can see that we already have a pretty decent car shape and I think this method is faster and easier than starting with a plane and extruding. I always try to find a faster solution for everything I make. Not a fan of pulling verts as you probably already know. Let's drop the subsurf level to 1 and apply the modifier, since we have to work on details now. I'm moving verts for window areas. When you're done, select these faces and inset. Then extrude inward and inset again. Press Ctrl 2 for a subsurf.
We'll do the same for the windshield but don't forget to press B for boundary. We have to work on the back glass as well. Let's add a cylinder to work on the wheel areas. Rotate in edit mode and place it in the front. Shift D to duplicate and place it in the back. Select the car and go into edit mode. Let's delete these verts. We now just have to move verts to fit the cylinder. I'm going to delete the back wheel and set origin to geometry for the front one. Scale it in edit mode. Add a subsurf in object mode, then go into edit mode again. Select these two faces. Change pivot point to individual origins and inset. Inset two more times and extrude inward. Inset three times and extrude outward. Inset two more times. As you probably guessed, I'm in setting a lot to create supporting loops. Move the tire in the X axis to the right and add a mirror modifier. Select the car as the mirror object. Duplicate the front wheel and place it in the back.
Let's select the loop that goes around the tire and extrude, right click, and scale. Do the same for the back wheel area. I'm gonna select this face and duplicate. Then separate to make the headlight Scale and extrude and add a loop cut. Don't set the origin point to geometry because there's the mirror modifier. Let's select these faces and repeat the process to make the bumper. We'll do the same for windows by duplicating the face loop and extruding. Select the edge loop and scale if needed for better shape. Now go through the same process for all the other frames and we're done. Hope you enjoyed making the car and I'll see you soon with another tutorial. Thanks for watching guys.